Welcome back to Monetized History. My name is Daniel. Today, we're going to be talking about the Republic of Artsakh and the Nagorno-Karabakh two-dram note. In southwestern Azerbaijan, there's a region known as the Mountainous Black Garden, Nagorno-Karabakh. For hundreds of years, the dominant ethnic group here has been Armenians, and in 1992, amidst the collapse of the Soviet Union, the region declared its independence from Azerbaijan. Although the new nation of Nagorno-Karabakh was not recognized by any member of the United Nations, it set about building and exercising the mechanisms of government, including issuing its own currency in 2004 in the form of a 2 and 10 dram note. These notes are seldom used in daily life. They were issued primarily to raise international awareness of their cause and to establish a national identity. Today, we're going to be looking at the 2 dram bill. For security features, it has threads embedded in the paper that fluoresce under UV light, microprinting that reads Nagorno-Karabakh Republic, and watermarks that read Print by OSD, OSD being the Austrian State Printing Office. Both notes can be found on eBay for less than $3. The value of the pair is a bit more than two cents. On the left of the obverse of the two dram bill is the coat of arms of Nagorno-Karabakh, known today as the Republic of Artsakh. In the center of the shield is the We Are Our Mountains monument, made by Soviet Armenian artist Sarkis Bagdasarian. Above this is the Medzkirs Mountain, one of the highest in southern Artsakh, which rises above the city of Shushi. It is known as the clenched fist of Artsakh. Below is the flag of Artsakh, which is nearly identical to the flag of Armenia. The white pattern on the fly end of the flag is evocative of traditional rug patterns from the region, but also represents the separation of Artsakh from Armenia and their hope for an eventual reunion. The eagle has been an Armenian symbol for over 2,000 years, dating from when Armenia was part of the Seleucid Empire. The crown above its head is that of the Artaxia dynasty, which ruled the Armenian Empire until its fall in 12 CE. In the eagle's claws is a mulberry branch, grapes, and wheat. In the center of the note is the Ganzasar Monastery, which was consecrated in 1240 by Armenian prince Jasan Jalal Today, it is the most popular tourist destination in Artsakh and is a symbol of national identity. On the right is St. Gregory the Illuminator. He's credited with the conversion of the Armenians in 301 CE, which led to Armenia becoming the first nation to adopt Christianity as its state religion. On the left of the reverse of the note is a bas-relief cross found on the western wall of Ganzasar Monastery. It is also visible as a latent image in the lower left corner of the note. To the right is the patron saint of Ganzasar, John the Baptist, depicted baptizing Jesus in the Jordan River. The image comes from an engraving by German artist Julius Schnorr von Karlsfeld for his famous picture Bible, completed in 1861. And now for the trivia. Are you ready? For one month in 1918, Armenia, Artsakh, Azerbaijan, and Georgia were part of a republic. What was the name of this country? If you think you know, let me know in the comments and I'll reveal the answer tomorrow. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Do you have any money from the Caucasus region? If so, let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe.